morning everybody. Oh, you know, just another day. Just another day in paradise. Oh, I think my camera lens is a little bit foggy. That's what that was an epic fail. Let me try and wipe it off first. Better? Hi. Beautiful morning. We are on our way to um, we're on our way to breakfast, so we have about 40 minutes to before breakfast ends. And yeah, you know, just waking up in the Indian Ocean, just a normal thing. <laughs> it's so nice, but I know that the water right now is probably like really, really cold. And you see, like the seaweed there. Like I need to get over my this psychological fear that I can't step on those. Because like every time I go near them yesterday I was like oh, no. I think it's just a phobia I, I feel like they're going to come up and pounce on me or some animals going to come up to me you know what I mean so we are gonna head off now to breakfast and yeah I had a really really good night's sleep and um, yeah we're gonna head off over there now are you ready I'll show you my outfit of the day. Doo -doo -doo. We're probably gonna change later for the beach, but this is just a casual morning outfit. I've got my New York, uh, what do you call that? My New York uh, tank top. My this skirt is from Mango. I've had it for a while, but I've never, never gotten around to wearing it. I don't know why. But I think it's cute, it's like a sarong. And then I've got my slippers. And my Kenneth Cole glasses that look like Ray-Bans. So that's pretty cool. Are you ready? The sun is shining. And all the children are making hay. If you guys know that song, yay. We are walking towards the place where the buggies are at. So, you know, just a morning walk. I just realized that I didn't put on any sunblock or whatever. So, let's hope that I don't get any sunburned. But I don't think I would. I haven't actually gotten sunburned before. Touch wood. But I get tanned like really easy. So, yeah. Look at the water. It's so blue. Sadly, how come there's no like seaweed in this area? The current? Because it's too choppy here? Probably. Why is it choppier here? Professor Mahmoud from the National Maldivian Marine Society shall give us his views. Sir? No, sir? Sir, no official comment, sir? Sir? Sir, no official comment? Seems that Mr. Mahmoud uh, was not prepared for this interview, so we shall check back with him later. I like vlogging here, like nobody looks at me weird. Like <laughs> they think that I'm just vlogging for a vacation, which I am, but it's uh, it's more acceptable. There are no vlogsists here, you know. I have this phobia walking on this plank that I might actually fall. Don't push me. That I might actually fall into the water. I don't know. It looks really nice, but. Ooh. So, this is where they do the weddings. Um, so pretty. Oh my god. Can I stand over there? I haven't been on a swing for a while, but I thought that it's timely that I start swinging again. You've probably learned how to bike so that I can bike around this island. Enjoying our breakfast and from our own little cup of no jug of coffee.
Thank you. And an amazing view, <clears throat> including this one. Here's my fruit palette. I've actually never eaten this before. I don't know. I was hoping that you would be able to tell me how to eat it. And I even have a raspberry smoothie. Enjoying my coffee. It's so perfect. And enjoying the view. So we just finished breakfast and it was very filling. I guess with a breakfast like that you don't need to have lunch. Yeah, so we're gonna head over to the reception and try and figure out the water sports activities for today. I think they wanted to do this uh, yesterday <laughs> and then we because we switched rooms so it was probably in the other room actually so the couple who probably got the other room were like oh wow look at the bathtub so it's our honeymoon so they wanted to make it special for us <gasps> oh my god so pretty so nice Very pretty la, pretty. So breakfast was really good. Um, very very filling. I think it's good that we didn't get the package with the lunch because we'll just make sure we stuff ourselves at breakfast and not need to eat lunch. <laughs> so we already booked our water sports stuff. We booked jet skiing and canoeing. So we are going to just chill. It's 11.30. What time do we have to go to the water sports area? Two? Yeah, so we have about one and a half hours to chill and do nothing. And enjoy this. It's actually really sunny so um, it would be nice to take a dip in the, in the pool, in our private pool. I think they're doing some maintenance there. Very pretty. And the people here are really, really friendly. Like, very hey guys, very quick one. We are on the way out to do some water spots. I'm not going to be bringing my camera, but we are going to go do jet skiing as well as uh, canoeing. So very excited. This is quick OOTD, and we're done. We'll see you guys. Hi guys. I probably look like shit, but <laughs> vlogging is more important than vlogging. Oh shit, right? So anyway, we just got back from an amazing time at um, the water sports area. We did, um, well he did jet ski and I just basically sat behind him. He uh, went a little bit fast, so in the end I did 15 minutes with him and then he just continued himself. How did you find the jet ski? How, did, how was the jet skiing? It was good. Good? And then we did 30 minutes of canoeing, which was awesome. I like canoeing. I think it's like, um, I'm not a very fit or active person, so canoeing is something that I can do and I can enjoy. I want to go do it again tomorrow. Maybe. I want to do canoeing again. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. So now we are just going to chill and enjoy the upcoming sunset. And then we're going to go to this restaurant called Senses. It's um, we're going to chill at the bar, and then we are going to have dinner there. It's lobster night there, so I'm pretty excited. So somebody, I won't mention who, but somebody jet skied so hard that he tore his shorts, <laughs> and it's now like a sarong. <laughs> Has it happened to you before? You were grinding the jet ski too hard. <laughs> Hi guys, outfit of the daytime. So just 
simple makeup from my Lorac palette. I'm actually using my new Sigma brushes and I am loving it. So um, I've got my earring here which uh, Mim gave it to me when he went to Sweden I think. And then for my dress, it's just this very very nice simple skater dress. I've never actually worn a skater dress before but this is from Cotton On. It's a size L and it fits like a dream so I really really like it. I'll be wearing my wedges with this outfit so yeah that's my outfit for the night. Show you guys in the big mirror. Ah much better so okay let's keep it this way. So this is the dress full view and then I'll be wearing these wedges with it. Yep. So we'll see you guys in a bit at dinner. Okay guys, we're at the lobster restaurant. We um, we got a special table that had that. How are you enjoying? Oh, I can't see you at all. <laughs> we just had a very lovely catch up with... I don't think you with, can um, see yourself. Can I? Can you see me? Not really. You can? How about like that? <laughs> Anyway, I can't wait to enjoy the lobster. So this is the starter. We decided to get the lobster set menu and we already devoured the starter there which is the um, the appetizer which is the Mediterranean breads and chapatis and we're gonna enjoy our lobster now. Enjoy! The lobster is here <laughs> and it's huge. We've got the grilled one and he's got the poached eggs. No, sorry. Yours stuffed. is what? Stuffed. Stuffed with cheese. And mine's the great one, Mediterranean style. And I've got my coffee. Yay! So, so we just got back from the restaurant and it was really nice. It's like lobster overload. And for some reason I am feeling very, very, very tired. Um, I almost fell asleep at the dinner table like twice. I only woke up because I saw like the lobster and I got excited. But yeah, there was some um, lobster starters, lobster soup, and then for the main is like grilled lobster for me. And then he had lobster stuffed with cheese and potatoes on the side. So it was really, really nice. And um, yeah, I think the service in this hotel is amazing. Uh, we met up with a friend of his who works here as a trainer to train the staff on like service culture and stuff like that so it was pretty cool um, yeah now I'm going to get ready for bed I think I'm pretty tired from all the activities that we did today so hope you guys enjoyed this day 2 vlog um, stay tuned for more